Here to help us shed some light on this case of Roger Ackroyd's murder is the famous detective Hercule Poirot. Okay. First of all, how did you figure out the crime? It was very simple. As, as I said before, no one can hide from Hercule Poirot and his little gray self. But what was your main strategy to figuring this out? A strategy? A great detective never needs a strategy. He just needs his observance and his little gray self. Why did you take the case in the first place? Wasn't there, there some doubt? There was no other option. Flora Ackroyd needed my help and support, and I, and I was there whenever I could. Do you think that somebody else could have gotten away with the murder? No, because as I said before, no one can hide from Hercule Poirot. Yourselves. Sorry. What about Dr. Shepard? What if he came forward? Do you think that would have cleared him? No, because he's still guilty of blackmail and murder. And what I think more is his sister Caroline would be heartbroken, and that would be, and he would he would be put on trial and shortly executed. What would have happened if he got away with it? No one can get away from Hercule Poirot and his little gray cells. As I said, uh, and, to, and to everybody there, listen to Hercule Poirot. Crime doesn't pay. Someone had have a chair at such an odd position, maybe to hide something. Good <laughs> <laughs> Here to help us shit. <shift. laughs> oh, yeah. Get a hold of it. Here to help shit. <laughs> <shift. laughs> oh, Dad, you can't You can't do it. I don't know. Maybe I need to do it. No. Is there anything you'd like to... Uh, no! It's okay, girl. 